Hi everyone, John Paul Brionis here from In Motion Hosting, and thank you for joining us for another video in our Getting Started series. Today I'm going to show you how to change your email settings in Thunderbird. There may be times when you need to either view your existing settings in Thunderbird or actually change your account settings in Thunderbird. So to begin, let's go ahead and open Thunderbird. As you see, I have it open already. I'm going to click the email account that I want to look at the settings for or adjust the settings for. And then I'm going to click view settings for this account. When you do that, it will bring this box up. Alternately, you can also right click on the email account and go to settings, which will bring you the same menu up, which is the account settings menu. Once it comes up though, you'll see it has a list of different settings available here. The main one we're going to click on here is server settings. When you do that, you would see either your IMAP mail server or your POP mail server listed here. And this is going to differ based on how you initially set it up. So if you set it up as IMAP initially, you'll see the IMAP settings here. If you set it up as POP, you'd see POP. And the main things we're going to look at here are the server name. In this case, I have it set to mail.example.com. And so right now, if I look here at the server name, this is my IMAP server next to server name. If I wanted to change it, I would just edit it as a test. I'll just make it example.com. And essentially, this would update my IMAP server. I could hit OK to cancel out. Uh, but at this point, I'm going to actually go down, and I'm going to click the outgoing server option here in order to view slash change my SMTP settings. So when you do that, you'll see your settings come up here. Go ahead and click Edit, which will bring that menu up. And you see your server name is listed there. That's the actual server name I'm using. My port is also listed. I could change my port if I wanted to. And then uh, in this case, I'm just going to change this as well to example.com instead of mail.example.com. Typically, though, you would just use mail.yourdomain.com for the standard settings. All right, once you've entered or once you've changed your server settings or written down your settings, if you just needed to find out the copy of them, go ahead and click OK, which would set your SMTP settings there. And then I'll hit OK to save my server settings here. If you see, it's still set to example.com. And I can actually just click OK to save this. Uh, in our previous article, we showed you how to actually set up Thunderbird. If you want to go see that article and learn how to completely set it up from scratch, a pop-up will come up on the screen. Go ahead and click that, and that'll take you to our full article on how to set up Thunderbird to check your email. Thank you for joining us for another video in our Getting Started series. Feel free to like this video and comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Did you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? There's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.